let me smurf you the story of the vile leaf. A dreadful adventure, one that's beyond belief. I smurfed this little poem to tell you the tale, with pictures I smurfed for added detail. Safe in their village, the place where they dwell, you'll find all the Smurfs who I'm sure you know well. There is Papa Smurf, our beloved leader, and the lovely Smurfette, you'll find no one sweeter. Handy, greedy, jokey, to name but a few, it would take hours to name all the Smurfs coloured blue. But far from the village where none dare to roam, lies a ramshackle hovel that the neighbour calls home. For he is a sorcerer, draped in black head to toe. He lives there alone with his cats, don't you know? Dressed in gaudy red boots, they look nasty and vile. According to Taylor, he has no sense of style. I speak of Gargamel, but that is no surprise. I'd smurf him on the nose if, if it weren't for my size. He has an obsession, his one and only thought. He wants to smurf the Smurfs for a stone of some sort. This time he has smurfed from a book of despair. A long lost formula to help him grow pears? Uh, no, not pears. Um, wait. Wait a minute. Um, that makes a mythical plant grow poisonous and dangerous. Ah, yes, that's it. And so he has smurfed using an ancient text. This most dangerous plant. And here's what happened next. Papa Smurf is distressed. Something has gone awry. Smurfs have gone missing. And we must find out why. There you are, Hefty. Hi there, Papa Smurf. Handy asked me to come see you. He put this weird machine on my back. He called it a Smurfizer. Yes, it's his Smurftastic new invention. It will allow you to heal all the contaminated plants that have Smurfed the village. And maybe Smurf some of the Smurfs who have disappeared. I hope so. But Handy told me that his machine needs a tank. Well, that's why you're here. Without it, you won't be able to use the Smurf Visor correctly. Its tank is a flower that I've been studying. You can Smurf it a little further down this path. It seems to have developed an immunity to the infection. Do you think it could solve our problem? Let's hope so. By the way, speaking of the Smurf Visor, you have the honor of being the first to Smurf this new invention. But I want to make sure you're still as strong with that equipment on your back. I'm the strongest Smurf, Papa Smurf, with or without the Smurfizer. But I can't practice with it, if you Smurf that it's necessary. I'd prefer that, Hefty. You can never be too careful. I Smurfed a little course for you. Let's begin your training. Make your way over to Farmer. He's Smurfing by the river. Let's make sure the Smurfizer doesn't make it too difficult to move around before we Smurf on. Papa Smurf told me to give you a test to make sure you can Smurf your mission. I know, Farmer. What do I have to do? Smurf your head up and look over there, on top of that cliff. Someone should be Smurfing at ya. There, it's Smurfette. She's so Smurfy. All right, time for some jumping.
There's more of that contaminated grass. I can't wait to heal it. That's their jumping course? I can smurf that with my hands behind my back. Yeah. Hey there, Hefty. What are you smurfing here? I'm looking for a strange flower that's supposed to help smurf this contamination. Oh, yeah. Papa Smurf told us that he'd set you a little challenge. Oh, I heard that you have to test out Handy's new invention. Yes, the Smurfizer. I'm learning how to use it. I'm smurfing as hard as I can to get the hang of it. Well, you better keep practicing, because you have to jump over that river ahead. Whoa, careful you don't smurf into the water. Don't worry, I know how to swim. I'm sure that you do, Hefty. But if you smurf into the water, the weight of the Smurfizer might make you smurf to the bottom. Oh, well, that'll be the end of your smurf. I'll be careful then. There's the flower! I'm sure it's the right one! It doesn't appear to be sick. It must be immune. I should be able to jump on that big mushroom to get up there. And... The village. I can't wait to show everyone the flower. It's sure to lift everyone's spirits. Yeah! Okay, I can see the flower in the distance. I have to keep going. I love jumping! There's no better way to smurf in shape. Better make sure I don't fall. I've got the flower! Mission accomplished! I'm the greatest, even with the Smurfizer on my back. Okay, time to smurf back to the village. I have to smurf this flower to Papa Smurf in handy, and fast! Handy, here's the magic flower that Papa Smurf asked me to smurf you. Thanks, Hefty. I can finally put the finishing touches to my Smurfizer. Are you sure it'll work, Andy? Oh, yes, Papa Smurf. You're in for a big surprise. It'll be goodbye contamination. You'll be able to reach all of the areas in the village that you couldn't before. I hope you mean the good kind of surprise, Andy. Remember what happened when you built those robots? Hefty has a point, Andy. You sometimes smurf inventions that you can't keep under control. Oh, don't be so pessimistic. The Smurfizer is my most accomplished invention. And the most effective. I swear on my Smurf. I can't wait to see it in action, Handy. We need to Smurf this contamination once and for all. Smurf me a few minutes so I can add the tank to the Smurfizer. There you have it. You're up, Hefty. Go heal the contaminated grass around the village and come back here when you're done. Hey, how's it going? Okay, I'll test the Smurfizer on that contaminated grass.
Hmm. Hello. No, there's no more healing spray. I used too much and smurfed the tank empty. I have to wait a little for it to recharge. I'm done, Papa Smurf. All of the contaminated plants have been smurfed. The Smurfizer is very effective. And it's easy to smurf, too. My invention is working perfectly. I told you so. By the way, the Smurfizer still has much to show you. When you're exploring outside the village, keep your eyes open. If you bring me materials, I'll be able to upgrade the Smurfizer. You have plenty of surprises in store. Okay, I'll keep my eyes peeled, Handy. Yes, but we still have a lot of Smurf to do, my little Smurfs. Some Smurfs are missing from the village. They were last seen heading to the dam. I hope they haven't disappeared like the others. You need to take a closer Smurf, Hefty. But be careful. The area surrounding the dam is contaminated. Use the Smurfizer to Smurf your way there. This is a chance to test my invention in the field. You can count on me. I'll find the missing Smurfs. And those contaminated plants had better watch out. day has arrived. I can finally smurf out the Smurfizer. Holy Smurf, what are those? They look like they've been contaminated too. A blast from the Smurfizer should do the trick. You look like you should be called Vile Balls. Hello there, Vile Balls. Smurf me down. Those must be the materials that Handy was talking about. If I collect enough of them, he'll be able to enhance the Smurfizer. I'll smurf your little bridge problem. Okay, the Smurfizer can heal the contamination, but maybe it has other powers too. Let's give that flower a little smurf. <laughs> Thanks, Hefty. That was some magic trick. Oh, it wasn't magic. That was Handy's latest invention. I can use it to smurf the contamination. Looks like you can also use it to clear a path. Yeah, pretty smurfy, huh? Anything's possible with the Smurfizer. Okay, gotta go. I'll go see if there are any more Smurfs to save at the dam.
must be one of those vile critters I heard about. Hmm. Let's see here. It has a mushroom head. Maybe I can jump on it, like the other mushrooms. Here we go. Time to show them what I'm smurfed of. Hey, that thing isn't looking too good. Maybe I should heal it. Looks like a contaminated heart. I'll heal it right away. Hefty, can you smurf me? This is your conscience, Hefty. You must. Quit smurfing around, Jokey. Come on, give me that. Give me that smurfy talkie. Hello? This is Papa Smurf. Can you hear me, Hefty? Papa Smurf? Is that you? I can hear you, but where are you? Inside the Smurf visor. Wait, let me explain. Andy forgot to Smurf you about the Smurfy Talkie. It's a device that enables long distance communication. This way we can stay in contact and you can Smurf information to us. Sorry about startling you. You know Jokey, he wanted to Smurf a little joke on you. That's all right, Papa Smurf. I'll smurf him a little lesson when I get back. So many vile critters, but I'll be happy to heal them using the Smurfizer. There's nothing like a little jump to smurf that I'm the best at bouncing. Hey guys, how's it going? Ah, oh, hefty. You smurfed here just in time. We can't smurf it anymore. What's the matter? Well, we were smurfing on the dam in peace when suddenly a seed fell from the sky. Whoosh! Into the ground. Bam! And it started growing. Whoosh! Then a strange plant suddenly sprouted. Pop! And it smurfed lazy, and he was sleeping nearby. Shabam! Pow! Blop! Whiz! Enough with the sound effects. What happened next? Well, we tried to smurf back to the village, lickety split. But we couldn't, because of the contamination. Well, luckily, you came to save us, Hefty. Yeah. It's a good job you can decontaminate the area with the Smurfizer. Okay, I'm gonna call Papa Smurf with the Smurfy Talkie. He'll come Smurf you up with a stork and take you back to the village. In the meantime, I'll go save Lazy. Hmm, that must be the weird plant those Smurfs were talking about. I'd better smurf it right away. Hello? 
Papa Smurf? I found the Smurfs at the dam. Smurf the stork to come pick them up. Lazy is still missing, but I'm gonna go get him back. It seems that he's trapped inside a strange plant that smurfed down from the sky. It smurfed down from the sky? Through the clouds? That isn't a good sign. Uh, actually, it was a seed that smurfed down from the sky. I don't have time to explain. Very well. You can smurf me all about it when you get back. However, I would like you to bring me a sample of that plant so that I can study it. No problem, Papa Smurf. See you later. And... Show them what this Smurf can do. sleep just yet the fun is just beginning <laughs> that horrible plant forever. No need to thank me, Lazy. That's what I'm here for. I haven't a smurf how this happened. I was working on the dam when suddenly I felt like smurfing a little nap. I lied down underneath the tree 
And when I woke up, I was trapped inside that horrible plant. And all of my friends had disappeared. I know. They told me all about it. A seed fell down from the sky and smurfed that mysterious plant. The others ran away, but you got captured while you were sleeping. In any case, I'm awake. <laughs> now, let's get back to the village. Quick. I can't wait to get back to my bed to smurf a well-deserved nap. I'm gonna smurf a piece of this plant to Papa Smurf so he can study it. I hope he'll find a way to get rid of it once and for all. So, Hefty returned with the sample in hand. Then Papa Smurf spoke up so they might understand. This plant, my little Smurfs, is called the Vile Leaf. It spits out mutant seeds that are sure to cause grief. From these seeds of evil, vile traps quickly will sprout. They will grow all around, they will spread all about. If you spot a vile trap, you had better beware, for they have but one goal, finding things to ensnare. The Smurfs asked a question. They didn't have a clue. Please tell us, Papa Smurf, what is it we must do? To destroy the vile leaf, you must find and find fast. Three rare ingredients, though it's no simple task. So, the list of ingredients to make an antidote for the vile leaf, it's very simple. I, I just need to remember what Papa Smurf told me. Uh, ah, yes, I, I wrote it down here. There, yeah, that's it. There is Aqua Magnifica, crystals coloured pink, and silver hellebores for their perfume that stinks. Papa Smurf is aware there is danger in store. Dark infested forests, lakes to cross, and much more. The Smurfs started talking, all sounding quite distressed. Who is crazy enough to set off on this quest? Amidst their bickering, only one hand was shown. Brainy volunteered to go there on his own. Equa Magnifica, he said. I'll get it, right? From deep in the forest, close to Wild Smurf's campsite. So I don't have a map, a chart, or a timetable? This seems so well organized, right? I'll go see Papa Smurf so he can tell me more about this mission. Hello, Papa Smurf. As you know, I volunteered, right? I was getting ready to leave, but I still need some information. Uh, um, yes, of course. Smurf to the source of the Agua Magnifica in Wild's campsite. But first, go see Handy in the clearing. He is repairing the bridge that leads to our dear friend's campsite. Very well. I have memorized that information with the greatest care, Papa Smurf. I hope that Handy has finished the bridge. I don't want to wait for too long. Hello! Is it's so nice right? that Papa Smurf trusts me. That said, it does make sense. I am his right-hand Smurf, right? I've accomplished every mission he's ever given me. Okay, I have to meet Handy in the clearing and fast. Hello? Hefty, can you smurf me? Unfortunately, I can, Brainy. What do you want? There's a vile critter that's hiding in the ground. I'm not sure I can get past. First of all, try to dodge its projectiles. It'd be a shame if it knocked you out. If you approach it, it will hide, leaving only a small stem sticking out of the ground. Try jumping on it, smurfing it with a smurf splat.
been smurfing on here? The vile bowls attacked us. Me, I don't like vile bowls. Where are they now? I'm ready to smurf them a lesson. They've gone. They've gone. They blocked the path by smurfing a landslide. Hmm, me? I don't like vile bowls. And I don't like blocked passages. Me neither, Grouchy. Maybe you could help me find another way through. Me? I don't like finding other ways through. Fine, I understand. I'll do it myself. If I could climb up high, I might have enough force to break that structure. Salut! Tu vaporises encore? the Smurfs. Ah! All right, Whitey. You can... Uh, wait. I've got to hang up. I think I've got company. Smurf? Sorry for smurfing up on you. I had an unexpected guest, but I managed to take care of him, <laughs> as you can see. Yes, indeed. So what did you want to tell me? Is everything smurfing along well? Yes, yes. The Smurfs who were trapped in the forest can now return to the village. I'm still heading towards Hank. Now I can move on. I need to reach the high ground. That fireball is much bigger than the others. Or maybe I need some new glasses. Is anyone there? Uh, hello? Brainy? It's me, Dimwitty. Oh no! You'll never be able to help me. I just smurfed an open present next to a cross smurfed on the ground. A present? For me? What was inside? This isn't easy. Nothing. It's probably another of Jokey's bad jokes. By the way, where is he? Maybe he's gone to smurf something to put inside my present. Yeah, Dimwitty, that must be it. Okay, I should keep going. He can't be far. Jokey's voice. Let's see what's going on. Help me, Brady, please! I 
promise this isn't a joke. Cross my heart. Holy Smurf! This place is Smurf with contamination. And there's a file trap, too. I must hurry before Gargamel arrives. Don't worry, Jokey. I'll Smurf you out of here. Okay, one more heart to heal. Then the vile trap will open. If it wasn't for you, Gargamel would have captured me. Ah, that would have been one really lousy joke. Tell me, how did you get yourself into this situation? I saw your open present and the mark on the ground, over there. I wanted to play a trick on Handy. I prepared a present that was supposed to fall into his hands when he stepped on the cross. It wasn't easy to set up, believe me. I believe you, Jokey. But just as I was about to hide, a vile ball appeared out of nowhere and startled me. So I stepped on the cross and my own present smurfed up in my face. Haha, <laughs> you got a smurf of your own medicine. I'm sorry I missed it. I panicked, so I ran away without looking where I was going and got caught in this vile trap. Next time, you'll think twice before smurfing stupid jokes, right? Okay, head back to the village. I have to keep going. And ha! Okay, now Joke can smurf back to the village. I can continue on my way. a serenade to that magnificent waterfall. Hey, I could do a smurf splat on those mushrooms. It would launch me even higher into the air, right? has disappeared. Handy must have taken it to cross the river. Oh, I hope that nothing bad happened to him. Don't worry, Smurfette. I'll Smurf another way to get across. See you later. <laughs> Yeah! 
guys. I've just found what's left of the raft. What's left of the raft? Did it get eaten? Nah, it was destroyed. The debris scattered across the water. Can you smurf it back together? I don't have any glue or magic powers. And more importantly, I'm not handy. By the way, where has he gotten to? I bet that he's passed out. <laughs> I don't think so. I can't see him anywhere. He must have kept going. Wait a second. Smurf me the Smurfy Talkie Chef. Hello, Brainy. Can you see anything else? Yeah, some of his tools are lying around. And hey, there are some planks too. If you use your imagination, you might be able to use them to cross the river. Think. Okay, there's a hammer missing from the toolbox. And I need one to resmurf that broken bridge. Ah, they immediately become contaminated again. Hmm, if I smurf a smurf splat from really high up, maybe they won't have the time to become contaminated again. Now I can get across. Hang in there, Handy. I'm coming. Smurf, I found a Smurf caught inside a vile trap. That's awful. Quickly, you have to free him. Gargamel could show up at any moment and capture him. I can see a few vile trap hearts to heal. I'll take care of them using the Smurf visor. Good luck. I'm counting on you. You know that you can always count on me, Papa Smurf. Right, Papa Smurf? Hello? <sighs> Looks like he hung up. tried to fend it off and I, uh, I ran away. Uh, but I still got captured. Oh, I'm so unlucky. 
What about Handy? Uh, I don't know. I ran away without looking back. Um, anyway, I, I didn't see him again. Whoa, good job. Papa Smurf always says you shouldn't abandon your friends, right? Go on, head back to the village. I have to go find Handy. Hello, guys. Can you smurf me? This is Hefty. Are you calling because you smurfed your leg? What? No! How could you say that? I'm telling Papa Smurf. I'm calling to smurf you that I saved someone. You should all be proud of me. But I have some bad news. Handy got smurfed by a vile trap. Holy Smurf, you have to do something before Gargamel finds him. Don't worry. I'm going to look for him at once. You'll tell Papa Smurf that I'm smurfing great on my mission. Right? Yeah, I'll tell him. Hey, what's that thing over there? It wasn't there earlier. Again. Handy won't be happy about this. <laughs> Speaking of Handy, it doesn't look like he's here. I have to keep looking for him. Hello, guys? I've just smurfed a large barrel. This is Chef. What do you mean, a large barrel? Uh, a big human-sized barrel. There's a rolling pin and spoon drawn on it. That's the emblem of Cooking Pot Castle, a prestigious cookery school. Well then. That must be where it came from. That's strange. It looks like humans have been picking sarsaparilla. Do you think they smurf it? No. Everyone knows they hate it. I've got to go. We'll smurf to the bottom of this later. First, I have to find Handy. Hmm. Which path should I smurf? Let me think. If Handy is caught in a vile trap, then he must be in a place smurfed with contamination. Good grief! That's just Smurfy! I have indeed found the most contaminated place! them when they strike the ground, right? I don't want to get smurfed like a bug. Hmm, it doesn't look like I can heal them either. gonna be smurfed in here forever hurry up I've had enough of being stuck in here there's a bunch of those nasty vile critters hanging around too don't worry they'll soon be gone thanks to the smart visor okay but first you need to heal that rotten vile traps contaminated hearts according to Papa Smurf that will weaken the plants and allow me to escape 
The vile critters are smurfed all over this area. I'll help guide you. All right. I'm coming, Handy. Watch out for the vile vines. If they crush you, you'll get smurfed to a pulp. Mushroom at the back, Brady. That way you can smurf the contaminated heart. You can do it, Brady! Time to head down to continue with the decontamination! There's one contaminated heart remaining. I have to smurf away to heal it. More Brady, I, I can no longer help you. So be quiet, right? Brady has told me to shut my smurf. Has the world turned upside down? Ha
Thank you, Rainy. You've smurfed up so much courage that I didn't recognize you. And I have more surprises in store. Papa Smurf is going to be proud of me for sure. I was supposed to meet you by the bridge leading to Wild's home. Yeah, before the Vile Trap captured me. As you noticed, I wasn't able to repair the bridge. There was too much contamination. What's more, I lost more than half of my tools on the way. Yes, I noticed. But I was able to find your hammer. By the way, I have to cross the river to get to Wild's home. But I don't know how. Hmm, I see. Just give me a minute. I need to think. Even without my equipment, I can still do a little tinkering for you. Give me my hammer. I'm going to smurf a few modifications. I'm a little worried. You're sure about this, right? Don't worry. I know what I'm smurfing. <laughs> there you have it. I'm proud to present, for the first time ever, the Smurfo Glider. You'll be able to glide through the air and smurf any challenge that awaits you. You can use healing spray to propel yourself along whenever you need to. Hmm, I'm not so sure about this new feature. You know me, Brady. My inventions always smurf a charm. No problemo. I wouldn't say that, right? But I'll give it a try. Okay, see you soon. I'll go smurf the udders to come get you. Hello, guys. It's Brainy. I have some good news. Some good news? Are you sure? Yes. I've cleaned the whole area and I saved Handy. Send the stork to pick him up right away. It pains me to say this, Brainy, but bravo. And that's not all. Thanks to Handy, I can now glide. I'll be sure to smurf the whole village that you're flying high. See ya! Go on, try gliding to the other side. And ha- Yippee! Great! Yippee! I'm flying! I'm gliding even closer to the stars! to smurf across by gliding over the broken bridge. <laughs> I love to glide. What a smurfy sensation.
can't wait to find Wild. He'll be thrilled to see me, his mentor, once again. Not to brag, but I taught him everything he knows, right? Okay, I see the entrance. Here we go. Finally, here I am in Wild's domain. It sure is pretty, but it's as wild as he is. I have to be on my guard. As Papa Smurf always says, better Smurf than sorry. Wild Adventures? What a Smurf's name is that? Has Wild been building something? Oh, visitor! Happy you come, Brainy! Me, happy, Brainy surprise visit! Rainy, you come. Oh, God. Me glad to see you. Oh, God. I am too, Wild. Papa Smurf always says, friendship is a precious thing that you need to smurf. <laughs> Brainy never change. Always talking for nothing. And you haven't changed either. You still speak in such a peculiar way. No, me change. Me worried. Contamination everywhere. Huck, huck. Don't you worry, Wild. Papa Smurf will find a solution. Incidentally, I need to smurf an ingredient from here to heal the contamination. Aqua Magnifica. Aqua Magnifica over there. An end of branch course. Huck, huck. You complete course. A challenge for you. A challenge? Well, okay then. I smurf your challenge. I never back down when I'm faced with obstacles. Papa Smurf is going to be so proud of me. Hey, that's new. Hmm. Judging by its shape, I should be able to bounce on it. isn't tricky enough it still isn't over i'm going to have to glide over to the other end honestly what in the smurf was he thinking the other smurfs won't be able to complete the course without the smurf visor i'll have to tell papa smurf Yum-yum area. A yum-yum area? Okay. Can you explain what this course is? Me? 
make adventure course for Smurfs. All come here to have fun. Yum yum area for rest. Eat and drink sarsaparilla juice. You smurfed all of this by yourself? That's very kind, Wild, but... But contamination everywhere. Course not finished because of contamination. Yeah, I noticed that. There are big holes in your course. You, continue course. No smurf the time. Ingredient at the end. Hawk, hawk. Okay then, Wild. I'm going. Hello? Papa Smurf? Can you hear me? Not very well. You're breaking up. It must be because of the trees. Have you smurfed wild? Yes. He asked me to complete a course with branch obstacles. With branch obstacles? What does that even mean? No. Branches in the trees. I have to finish the course to smurf the Aqua Magnifica. What's that about a disease? You're not sick, are you? No, I'm fine, Papa Smurf. Okay, I've got to go. My challenger waits. Beard. Let's hope I have enough spray to glide over to the other end. Smurf Pfizer, don't fail me now. me. You know a shortcut, right? Aqua Magnifica source just there. You take ingredient. Is that the Aqua Magnifica? You're joking, right? No. I did that entire course just to get some... water? I'm sorry to say this, but I don't see what's so Magnifica about this water. Spellbook of Papa Smurf tells stories that make want some. Me, always Smurf bath in Aqua Magnifica. <laughs> in any case, thank you. You help me find the first ingredient that will smurf the contamination. You, come back with friends to Smurf Adventure Course 
and drink sarsaparilla juice. I promise. We'll come back and see you as soon as we finish smurfing the contamination. But you need to work on the course. It's far too dangerous, right? You know that safety is no smurfing matter for Papa Smurf. Me make course safe, and friends all come back later. Hock -hock. Perfect. See you soon, Wow. Now, back in the village, there's an air of panic. Some Smurfs even cancelled their upcoming picnic. When they saw the Vire Leaf spreading seeds to invade, those wise Smurfs decided to build barricades. However, Dimwitty, he went off for a stroll, whistling and unaware of what could take its toll. Without showing caution, he walked on deep in thought. Then a vile trap appeared, snatched him up, he'd been caught! But you should know the vile trap, that evil creation, can show Gargamel the village's location. Once a plant nabs a smurf, therefore sealing his fate, it signals the wizard who's lying in wait. To stop this from happening, the smurfs have to succeed in saving Dimwitty from that horrible weed. But look who has returned, equipped with all that gear. It is indeed Brainy! So there's nothing to fear. Am I smurfing? Where's my hero's welcome? They could have at least organized a great feast in my honor, right? <laughs> Brainy, you're finally here. Yes, Papa Smurf. I have retrieved. Not now. We have to help Dimwitty. There's no time to lose. He's been smurfed by a vile trap. It can lead Gargamel straight to the village. Dimwitty is in the central square, and it's been invaded by the contamination. Uh, what? Holy Smurf. That thing is aptly named. Before I can even catch my breath, I have to smurf the hero once again. Oh, hi. How's it going? to go and save that dimwit dimwitty. They should have been cheering for me when I brought back the Aqua Magnifica. But no, all they could think about was dimwitty.
Tim Witty, it's me, Brainy. I've come to save you. See me. Do you want to carry? Been more careful, Dimwitty. I warned you that Gargamel can use those plants to smurf the location of the village. You put all the smurfs in danger. Oh, I thought you wanted me to smurf into the plant. It's no use trying to explain. You're smurfing your breath. Need I remind you that I have returned from a long journey? Right? I also managed to bring back the first ingredient, the Aqua Magnifica. Is anyone interested? Congratulations, Brainy. Thanks to your courage, we only have two ingredients left to find. It was like smurfing fish in a barrel. With my superior intellect, I can overcome any challenge that... Uh, did you go on a trip, Brainy? <sighs> He's smurfing me crazy. I'm going to get some well-deserved rest. And so, Brainy helped Dimwitty to escape, and he apologized for his silly mistake. But I have more bad news, declared Papa Smurf. More Smurfs have disappeared, like Smurf and also Smurf. To save the missing friends immediately, they must concoct the cure mentioned previously. Finding the pink crystals, it could be a hassle for they are located in Cooking Pot Castle. Cooking Pot Castle, a great culinary school, where chefs learn to cook meals that would make your mouth drool. A Smurf who knows that place, there exists only one. He's the Smurf we call Chef. His mission has begun. I once had dinner at Cooking Pot Castle. Don't get me wrong, it was nice, but it wasn't that, you know. Anyway, uh, yes, anyway, uh, moving on. It's so nice to be going to Cooking Pot Castle. My mouth is watering already. Apparently, Handy wants to see me before I... Hello there, Chef. I've got a surprise for you. I've smurfed a few improvements to the Smurfizer. By the way, if you find any materials on your journey, don't hesitate to smurf them to me. The more you give me, the more I can improve the Smurfizer. Pretty smurfy, right? Oh, I can't wait to see that. But didn't you say you had a surprise? Haha, <laughs> yes. I upgraded the Smurfizer to help you through Cooking Pot Castle. Hi. You can now use the sprint. You'll be able to move around much faster. That's great. I'll be able to challenge Hefty to a race then. Thanks to the sprint, you'll also be able to break things. There are a few plants next to my workshop. One of them has just poked its little head out. Try smurfing into it by sprinting. By hitting it, you'll be able to make the others come out. But you have to be quick, or they'll all go back into the ground. Then, you can go beat up with Papa Smurf.
Are you sure you'll be able to smurf the pink crystals from the cooking pot castle? As sure as you need to break eggs to make an omelet, Papa Smurf. There's a supply of crystals inside the castle. How do you know that place so well? Uh, it's a long story. I've got to go. The clock is ticking. You can count on me to bring back the second ingredient, the pink crystals. Hmm. You and I need to have a little talk when you return. Hi, are you still spraying? It'll be a piece of cake. I just have to enter the castle and smurf the pink crystal. This mission will be as easy as smurfing boiled eggs. If I sprint forward with the help of the Smurfizer, it'll give me a little boost and I can Smurf through that structure. Smurf, even more things to heal. Hey, I should try running into it to make it fall. Let's go. Take that in your smurf.
There isn't a human in sight. This place is usually crowded. I haven't been to the castle in ages. I can't wait to smurf my dear friend, Chef Tok Tok. Castle, but something's not right. The front door is locked. I have a bad feeling about this. I'm afraid this mission is going to turn sour. So, how are you going to get in? My friend, Chef Tok Tok, made a small entrance just for me. I hope it hasn't been locked too. If I remember correctly, by following this wall, I can get to the small passage that Chef Tok Tok smurfed for me. If I run fast enough, I can pass through. And this smurfs no sense at all. The passage that Chef Tok Tok made for me is closed too. Something smells fishy. And... a little high. I should try sprinting onto that mushroom to give me a boost. The contamination is spreading like hot butter on toast. It's rising faster than a souffle. I need to smurf up the drain pipes to heal the hearts. That'll put a stop to it. <laughs>
Hello, guys. Are you there? I think I found a way to smurf into the kitchen. You're going over the outer walls, right? Yes. I have to jump into the air and smurf to the top. Be careful, chef. Don't go breaking your smurf. Don't you worry, Papa Smurf. See you later. Okay, this Smurfo glider is going to be very useful. Good thing I'm not afraid of heights. Oh no, the contamination is coming out of the window. Has the contamination managed to smurf all the way inside? That would explain why everyone is gone. The last time I came here, there were chefs in training everywhere. Gee, these platforms are as sturdy as rotten crackers. strange place. It must be the castle storeroom. There must be another exit smurf somewhere higher up. Hey, 
please, I've made it! I can see the end of the wall, all the way over there! I must admit, I'm a little worried. The contamination has smurfed everywhere. It looks horrible, just like lumpy custard. Do you think it could be... Another vile trap? Yes, it must be inside the castle. That would explain why it's spreading so much. Okay, gotta go. I'll call you back later. This is the first time that Chef Tok Tok hasn't been here to smurf me welcome. I wonder if there are any humans left around here. Finally, a place that I recognize, the terrace balcony. But there used to be tables and chairs here. Now, all that's left is some old debris. How could Chef Tok Tok and his students have smurfed this place in such a mess? Okay, we can smurf about that later. Let's go. There's a small entrance for me around here somewhere. Oh, my God. 
Okay, I finally reached the outer walls. Now, to get to the kitchen. It's in the large central tower. You can see it in the distance. It's impossible to miss. like a crumbled cookie. I have no choice. I'm going to have to smurf over that gap and glide across. <laughs> I love smurfing through the air. I feel as light as meringue. I think I can see a vile trap in the distance. It's closed. There must be something or, or someone inside. Holy smurf. This confirms our suspicions about the progress of the contamination. Brainy, go check and see if any smurfs have gone missing. Wow! It's gonna take ages for you to count everyone. I'm hanging up. the cellar. All these barrels seem to contain sarsaparilla juice. The castle chefs have been stocking up. Let me see if this juice was made from the contaminated sarsaparilla. chance to sprint as fast as I can and beat Hefty's record.
is. I can also see the small entrance that my friend Chef Tok Tok built for me. I need to jump over that gap and glide over to the other side, safe and sound. It should be a piece of cake. Surprised! When he heard I was coming here, he couldn't have resisted the urge to come smurf his face. You can count on me, Papa Smurf. I'll smurf him out of there. Ouch! So nice to be back here. This is what I hid to listen to Chef Tok Tok's classes. Hello, guys. I've just found a cookbook lying on a stand. Use it to learn a few new recipes. A change would be nice. Ah, no. I'd better not smurf this for you, Brainy. There is sarsaparilla juice in the recipe, but also, and I quote, a strange new plant, strong in taste, and that grows quickly. The file trap. Do you think the castle chefs were eating file traps? That might be why the castle has been abandoned, right? Definitely. Okay, got to go. I'll tell you if I find anything else.
but there's no way to reach it without being hit by the vile vines. Unless I use the Smart Visor to charge through at full speed. you out of there oh thank you chef what great news I couldn't stay here a second longer I'm starving can't say I'm surprised I just need to heal the contaminated hearts then you'll be free Did you get yourself into this situation, Greedy? <laughs> when I heard you were going to Cooking Pot Castle, <laughs> I couldn't resist. <laughs> Just the thought of the thousands of dishes you can usually smurf here, <gasps> my mouth was watering. And you snuck away to come here? Yes, I took a stork. And when I got here, I searched the kitchen. But all I could find were these large, salty rocks. Salty rocks? That's the ingredient I need to bring to Papa Smurf. Wait for me here. When I return, we'll head back to the village together. Finally, the kitchen. I know this place like the back of my smell. Wow! Are they all crazy? They've been cooking vile traps. That explains everything. They are all out of their smurf. That's why they... There! The pink crystals. Chef Tok Tok told me why they're so rare and why he had trouble getting them. They come from a faraway land, in the mountains, I think. They give his recipes their unique and peculiar taste. Ah, I sound just like Brainy. Now that I have a piece, I can meet up with Greedy and head back to the village. Oh, hi. What are you doing? Where is Papa Smurf? I have to give him the second ingredient. Papa Smurf isn't here. Me? I don't like Smurfs who aren't here. Not here? Well, do you know where he is? Yes. In the swamp. He said that there was no time to lose. And that he was going to look for the hellebores. Me? I don't like hellebores. Hmm. Papa Smurf still hasn't returned. And the village is in a mess. Me? I don't like messes. Oh no, what's smurfing on now? 
Okay, I'm gonna go put the crystals in his lab, safe and sound. During the adventure in that faraway place, the Smurfs in the village started acting in haste. Papa Smurf, too eager and wanting to do more, set off for the swamp to find silver hellebores. As the hours rolled by, the Smurfs began to fret. Papa Smurf is still gone. Why isn't he back yet? Has he been taken captive or caught in a trap? Does he need to be saved from some sort of mishap? As their meeting went on, voices called out to state. Should they replace him or continue to wait? As the Smurfs in the village continued to groan, Smurfette was concocting a plan of her own. Suddenly she noticed the gear left unguarded. Grabbing the Smurfizer, she swiftly departed. Heading through the forest and without turning back, she pursued Papa Smurf by following his tracks. Oh no, it's Grouchy. Hey Grouchy, pretend you didn't see me, okay? Me? I don't like pretending. Hmm. Where are you going anyway? I'm going to find Papa Smurf. I'm smurfed up just waiting around. Please don't tell the others. They might get worried. All right. Me? I don't like getting worried. I can't believe that Grouch snitched on me. He didn't snitch. We heard him grumbling even more than usual. That's what made us realize something Smurfy was going on. He was angry at himself for letting you go. He's worried that something might happen to you. And we're worried about you too. Come back to the village, Smurfette. It isn't safe out there. No way. I'm just as Smurfy as any one of you. So stop your Smurfing. What did she say? She doesn't want to come back! No, wait. Uh, Smurfette, I just wanted to let you know, before you left, I made a few adjustments to the Smurfizer. It can now suck up and shoot out all kinds of things. Uh, I would... I would have liked to show you how it Smurfs, but seeing as you left... Don't worry, I'll figure it out on my own. Thanks, Handy. See you soon. I can use Handy's latest upgrade. Okay, let's try pressing this button. Great! It's working!
the swamp. No Smurf has ever brought me here on a picnic. Now I understand why. This is one gloomy... What is it now? How am I supposed to heal something up there? You know what, you ugly thing? I'm going to suck up these vial balls and fire them back at you. <laughs> full of barrels doing here? I hope there aren't any humans around. That's never a good sign. to suck up a healing plant and fire it at the contaminated heart. I have to act fast. This place doesn't look sturdy. Wow, it's a free-for-all today. It doesn't seem to be affected by the healing spray either. Oh, great. Let's see now. How about I suck it up? Now what am I supposed to do with it? Descender! Go on, get out of here! Smurfette, and we're all ears. Shh, it's Smurfette. She's so sweet. Be quiet, she's gonna say something. I found a lantern near the dock. Whoa. It must belong to Papa Smurf, but I couldn't see a raft here. Papa Smurf must have used it to cross the river. You're on the right track. Well done, Smurfette. Ask her if she's okay. Oh, ask her if she wants me to go help her. Hey, that's enough. I'm a big girl. I can take care of myself. like smurf tracks. They seem to be fresh too. Oh, this is just as I feared. 
There's a human nearby. are strange. I don't know why there are so many of them. Ah, this swamp is so clammy and damp. What a calamity. Oh, I feet all wet. Holy Smurf, it's Carcamel. Those were his footprints. Up there, the log. I have to reach it to move on. But I need to be careful. Gargamel can't be far away.
again. Gargamel must be gathering ingredients here. But what? And more importantly, why? Smurf isn't too far away, and that Gargamel decided to go home and feed his cat. More barrels. So Gargamel is still here, and he's stocking up a huge supply of something. Slippery? I don't know where to tread. This swamp is repulsive, disgusting, and dirty. A vile trap. I hope that Papa Smurf isn't inside. That's just Smurfy. I can't see anything because of this fog. I could call out to him, but seeing as Gargamel is lurking around here, I'm sure to get caught. I'll be smurfed! The vile trap must have sent a signal to Gargamel! I have to hurry! Alright, I have to get closer, find the hearts, then heal them to open the vile trap. I 
have no choice. I have to go through that fog. All right, I need to suck up some healing spores to smirk a way through. Murphy? It looks like the path of leaf. Okay, I've healed the first heart. There must be another one. It seems that Gargamel hasn't found the vile trap. That's great news. Hello, Smurfette? It's us. Is everything alright? Yes, I'm fine. Stop smurfing me every five minutes. is a real nuisance. Even if a vile trap has caught something, I wouldn't be able to see it. Hmm, so that one hasn't smurfed anything either? That's convenient. This is my chance to go open that vile trap. Wow, that looks like the fireworks we smurf in the village every year. A tee hee hee serves him right.
And there, the last heart has been healed. Papa Smurf! Can you hear me? Is that you, Smurfette? Were you the one who got the vile trap to free me? Yes! I'm coming, Papa Smurf! Stay where you are! I won't move a muscle! By the way, I have some good news, Smurfette! I managed to collect the Hellebore's perfume before I got Smurfed. Smurftastic! Then we can go back to the village right away! Quickly! We can't hang around here. Gargamel is nearby! Did I just hear someone cry out? Perfect! Ah! Can you hear me? Are you okay? I'm alright! But that was some drop! I sure picked the right time to fall! The Smurfizer doesn't seem in such good shape, though. The tank came off, and I can't see it anywhere. Holy Smurf! It must have been carried away by the river. Hurry! You have to get it back! Without that special flower, we won't be able to heal the contamination. Yes, I know. I'm on it. In the meantime, you should head back to the village, Papa Smurf. The Smurfs are a little jittery. They need you there with them. Are you sure? I can wait for you here, you know. No! The village needs you more than I do, Papa Smurf. Besides, Gargamel might still be lurking around. It isn't safe. I would rather stay, but so be it. Take care of yourself. I've handled things perfectly so far. I'm sure I'll be fine. to the water with all these obstacles. All those noises. Oh, it sounds like insects. Or maybe the vile critters? <sighs> Come on, I have to control my fear. I can't let my imagination get the best of me. It's now or never to try Hefty's famous technique. Run fast! Yeah! Awesome! Yippee! And up! Owie! Is again. I'm feeling a little worried. Uh, 
I'll try to avoid getting too close to that contamination. and get back to the village. Smurf-tastic! I finally got the tank back. I feel quite proud of myself. I can't wait to get back to the village and see my friends. Okay, I'd better not hang around. There's something smurfy about this place. With the help of Smurfette and her immense courage, our two heroes safely return to the village. Oh, I was certain that she would succeed. She is truly remarkable. Ah. Anyway, where was I? Once Papa Smurf got back, he set things in motion. He took out his cauldron to brew up the potion. The perfume of hellebores he proceeded to add to the ingredients that they already had. Now, his work is complete. Papa Smurf is content. The antidote was smurfed after several attempts. But it's not over yet. To defeat Gargamel, they must head to his home to break the vile leaf spell. The plant spits out its spawn from the hovel on top. There's a long road ahead to bring it to a stop. But. Who is the right Smurf to be sent on this quest? Oh, not lazy, not clumsy. They aren't up to the test. It is indeed hefty, for who else could it be? Ready to battle and make history! Great! I have everything. I can go save my friends from Gargamel. But first, I should go see Papa Smurf and Handy. Oh, hello! Using the three ingredients we've found, I've concocted a super antidote. And I filled the Smurfizer with it. Perfect! Now I'm ready to face the Vile Leaf. Just one thing, the Smurfizer is now very powerful, so don't be surprised. I know all about power. Don't you worry, Handy. 
You have to sneak into Gargamel's hovel and free the Smurfs that he has taken prisoner. Then, you must put an end to the vile leaf using the Super Antidote. The antidote is powerful, but the vile leaf is too. Don't forget that. Don't worry, Papa Smurf. I'm Smurfed up and ready to go. And the vile leaf there. I need to be very careful. Hello, guys. Can you hear me? Yes. This is Papa Smurf. Have you arrived at Gargamel's house? Yes, but it's pitch black out here. I can barely smurf a thing. That might help you get inside unnoticed. I know stealth is not your forte, Hefty, but try to be discreet for once. Don't sweat it, Papa Smurf. I'll be as quiet as a fly. Yeah! Awesome! Holy dumbbells! It's Gargamel! Let's hope he doesn't see me. What's he up to this time? Now, a little nightshade and a smidge of ricin. That should make the vile leaf grow. And not forgetting the mandrake. <laughs> Azrael, I can't find the hellebores I picked from the swamp. I hope you didn't gobble them up when I wasn't looking, you blasted flea bag. Hellebores? From the swamp? Smurfette did say he was gathering something while he was there. I'll break down that structure in the blink of an eye, or my name isn't Hefty. Hmm? What was that noise? Was that you, Azrael? Oh, Smurf, he must have heard me. It's a good thing I'm well hidden. What well, have you broken this time, you n- It must be another one of those cursed rats. Spellbook. He must have used it to learn how to smurf the vile leaf. You're a big 
chicken, Gargamel! Are you really scared of a tiny little rat? It's more scared of you than you are of it! Pipe down, you nasty blue imps! Once I've taken care of this rat, you're next on my list! Oh, wow! I don't believe it! Hefty, what are you doing here? Have you come to save us? That's right! Did Gargamel capture you after you got caught in the vile traps? I have a feeling he's going to smurf us! Yeah, but you can free us later. First, you have to destroy the spellbook. Gargamel has found a new formula to enhance the vile leaf's power. He's returned from the swamp with a bunch of ingredients. So that's why he was in the swamp. No more spellbook means no more formula. Then, it's bye-bye enhanced vile leaf. You have to get rid of it. Just as I suspected, I need to get into the room with the spellbook without Gargamel seeing me. Um, uh, there's a mouse hole? Over there, high up? You need to get close to the spellbook without being seen. All right. I'll try smurfing that way. I'll come set you free afterwards. It'll be a breeze with my strength. The mouse hole is right up there. Here we go. some of the captured Smurfs. That's great news. Have you been able to free them? No, not yet. I have to destroy Gargamel's spellbook first. He's found a new formula to make the Vile Leaf even stronger. In that case, stop him before things get out of hand. Don't worry, Papa Smurf. I'll Smurf things under control. Growing old, I can tell you that much, Hazrael. Unpleasant thing about this hovel is the owner. I should come Smurf a visit when he's not around. I can see you, little rat. I'll deal with you. Just let me get my net. There's that idiot Gargamel again. Has he got nothing better to Smurf than chase me? After all the training I've done, there's no way he can catch me. Ow! 
Run. <laughs> you never smurfing, Gargamel! Look out! Behind you! <laughs> you never smurfing, Gargamel! Look out! Behind you! <laughs> He's like a stork at a china shop! <laughs> One more word out of you, and I'll turn you into cat chow! Come on, just a little further. It can't be far now. The whole village is counting on me. I can't give up. Smurf up everywhere. Owie! in here. That horrible smell must be coming from Gargamel's cauldron. Hey, his old spellbook is just above it. I'm nearly there. Gargamel, I want to smurf you something. Gargamel, I can hear water running in the kitchen. Do you have a leak? Stop distracting me. I'm going to catch that rat, I tell you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Enough of all these pests. What's the point of having a cat if it won't do any hunting? Yeah. Oh, great! The spell book is right there. Finally, there's that nasty spell book. It's covered in the contamination. A little blast from the Smurfizer should destroy it. Oh! Where did you come from, you little rat? You'll get what's coming to you! Holy Smurf! Quickly! I need to heal it and Smurf out of here! My beautiful spell book, you cast blue imp! I saw you! Ah! You won't get away from me this time, you vile blue vermin! with those tiny legs. <laughs> oh, no, this could end badly. I have to keep moving. through that hole. You won't escape from me! Hefty! We're over here! Come help us! Hurry, Hefty! We need you to smurf us free! Break the lock before Gargamel finds out! Get up high and use a smurf blood on it! It should break! Got it! I'll be quick! the time to smurf the plunge. And... Wow, thank you, Hefty. I thought we'd never get out of that cage. Free at last! I don't know about you, but I hate being locked up for too long. Yeah, Gargamel moved out caged around so much that I got seasick. Uh, by the way, did you manage to free the other smurfs? No, not yet. But don't worry, I'm on my way. No! That blasted smurf freed the others! This has gone far enough! I'm gonna turn you into cat chow! Holy smurf! He's back! Time to start running again! Let's go! Whoa! Gargamel has really been stocking up on ingredients. Over there! That flower looks like the hellebores Papa Smurf picked.
So, you little monsters, you really thought your little friend was going to save you? He'll have to find you first! <laughs> Oh, look! Our savior has returned! Hefty! <laughs> wow, thank you, Hefty. We're free at last, thanks to you. We can go! We can go! Oh, this is so smurfy! Okay. There's no time to lose. I still have to heal the vile leaf. Yeah, it's in the attic. Gargamel won't stop talking about it. In the attic? Where is this attic? Uh, I think that it's upstairs. <laughs> yeah, because a downstairs attic is called a basement. <laughs> this is no time for smurfing around. Where's the entrance to the attic? Oh, you can't smurf it. It's where there's the most contamination. Keep going straight ahead. All right, I've got to go. Good luck. Hello, guys? I freed the last of the imprisoned Smurfs. You can send the stork to come pick them up. They're outside. Are you sure Gargamel won't smurf his wings when he sees them? He'll be too busy looking for me. He won't see anything from above. I've got to go. I'm heading into the Vile Leaf's lair. Be careful, Hefty. The Vile Leaf is still very powerful. Great! Ah! Would you stop jumping everywhere? Oh, wow. I've never seen so much content. Never oh, wow. I've never seen so much contamination. This must be the entrance to the attic. Let's go. Finally, here's the attic. Let's get down to business. With the help of the ultimate antidote, the vile leaf will soon be decontaminated. The obstacles are still dangerous, though. I have to stay alert. Hello? Guys? Can you hear me? Guys? It's Hefty. Do you copy? Over there! The vile leaf! Holy smurf, it's gigantic! And there are its three hearts. I have to smurf away to reach it. Hearts. I bet they're like those blasted vile trap hearts. But a lot tougher. They're no match for the ultimate antidote, though. Papa Smurf made that clear.
may be on my own, but let's not forget, I am Hefty after all. Every Smurf knows it. Hefty is the strongest Smurf. The file leaf might try to defend itself, but I'll show it what I'm made of. <laughs> Smurfsy turvy. Either the violin. I know you're in there, you cursed Smurf. You must be dreaming if you think you can destroy the vile leaf. You're in for a rough time when those vile critters get hold of you. <laughs> oh no, that's just what I needed. are stopping me from getting through. Ha <laughs> ha ha! That idiot Gargamel got smurfed by the roots. Finally, I can catch my breath. Phew! It's a real maze in here. Where should I go?
Nossa! Papa Smurf? <sighs> it's over. I can finally Smurf a little rest. The Fire Leaf is beaten! The village has been saved! With the help of teamwork, we've succeeded today. They're united once more. It's a Smurf Jubilee! Even Grouchy seems glad. Well, to a certain degree. Papa Smurf smiles as well, his little Smurfs prevailed, and thinks of Gargamel, who has once again failed. He cursed and he raged for a very long time, ensnared by the vile leaf, tangled up in his vines. But the plant then dried up, liberating that beast, who still is unwilling to admit his defeat. But forget about him, we will leave him to brood. For the flowers and plants, they have all been rescued. So, we'll now return home beneath a starry sky and sing all together, waving danger goodbye. For a Smurf should always celebrate and have fun, showing friendship and joy, caring for everyone. <sighs> I'm glad that's over. I, I, I smurf poetry, but smurfing rhymes all day long is smurfy work. Anyway, thanks everyone. We, we should do this more often. Take smurf of yourselves and have a good smurf.